What's going on guys? We're up in Keene, New York today. Right behind me is Cascade Lake. Also, I got Ginny, Jeff, and Mom behind me. We are walking over to Buster, Bowser, and Bruiser. Three nice moderate ice climbs. All right, here we go. We just got to the base of the ice, as you can see behind me. This line is called Bowser. I believe it's a WI2 slash three, depending on what line you choose. There's already a nice piece of protection on that tree up there, so we'll be able to wrap down nice and easy without leaving any of our own gear. I'm thinking that this looks like a nice warm-up climb, first climb of my season. Mel, I mean, Mom, how was the approach? Very nice. Nice. Oh, so one thing, hey, I was talking to John the other day, yeah. and one thing he was saying was when there's not a lot of snowfall on the ground, the top outs of climbs can be a little sketchier okay. because it goes from when the ice starts forming, yeah. right above that it'll be rock and dirt. It yeah, won't be like packed rich. snow, so. So when you're topping out, just kind of take it a little slow. All right, where are you going first? Oh, you're going up there. Right okay. to the tree. Right to the tree, right over this. You ready? Yep. All right, I think I'm actually going to put a piece in just so I don't go tumbling down. I think that's a good idea. Jeff, do you have enough gear? Yeah, I have six screws. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, when we did that warm up picture at Romney, I'm scary. like, oh, this is short, this is easy. Yeah. Yeah. All right, just stay right with me, you know. Spicy little finish here. Okay. Oh, yeah. Whew. That was awesome. Just made it to the top of my first ice climb of the year. It was Bowser a WI2 slash three. I did pretty good though, felt pretty confident. The end got a little bit sketchy because last time I was here, the ice went all the way up to the tree, but we still managed. All right, I think we're good to go. Yeah, nice view behind me here. That's Cascade, Upper Cascade Lake right here. Nice white scenery. Use whatever you can. Yeah. Well, everything's just all rotten right here. When you're ice climbing, everything's on. Nice job. Thank you. Good job. Good belay. Thank you. That was really exciting. A couple of times when I was going to sink my ice axe in, the ice would just shatter away. 
and one time a huge piece a huge piece shattered almost took my feet off so that was a little a little exciting this is where it ended up down yeah here <laughs> that's a pretty big feet. piece that's one of the smaller pieces that yes. hit me too and then when I got to the top, the ice kind of disappeared and was getting a little slushy. So I was just kind of staying focused. And like I said before, when you're ice climbing, everything's on. I was grabbing roots, dirt, everything. So <laughs> you ready to go? Sure, you're still on belay. Well, are you ready to climb? Yes. Leave it as a top rope if possible. This ain't no hero ice. Oh. Yeah. All right, we're all finished in this area now. I think, I think the plan is we're gonna either go left or right because there's ice on either side of us. Whatever's free, we're gonna go hop on. All right, here we go. <laughs> All right, guys, that's a day from us. We're just getting back to the car now. Everybody else is scrambling down behind me. Awesome day of ice climbing over here at Upper Cascade Lake on Buster and Bowser. Really fun day. We're gonna be winding down at the hotel the rest of the night, just hanging out. But hit that subscribe button because we are coming back out tomorrow. We are heading over to Chapel Pond Cave. Chapel Pond, Chapel Pond something. Pay attention, I'll see you there. Jeff, good job today. Thank you, sir. Love climbing with you. Good time. Ginny! Yeah. Good job today. Thank you. Whew. You look like a blueberry. <laughs> good job today. Thank you.